What's up, my homies? It's your girl, Madge. Welcome or welcome back to my channel if this is your first time. Thank you so much for visiting. I do contents about beauty, travel, and music. So if you're interested, please consider subscribing and hit that notification bell para naman updated ka sa upcoming videos ko. In this video, we are going to try out Antlutz brushes, eye essentials. So kung wala ka pa nito and you're curious, Kung ano ang laman ng bag na ito, just keep on watching! This is my first time to use Antlitz Brushes Eye Essentials. I'm very, very excited about that. Actually, I have the Antlitz Brushes version 2.0. You should watch that video. Ilalagay ko na lang sa card up here or sa description box below. And on that video, um, let me just share na they featured us in the um, in their Facebook page and Instagram account. So thank you so much, Antlitz Brushes. So now, okay, so what's inside? Inside, there is a card here with Mama Antlitz picture and uh, instructions on how to use the product and their social media handles. Right, so when you open, ito na yung brushes niya. So merong 10 brushes. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So overall, 10 brushes. This costs 800 pesos. Kasama na yung bag or pouch. So lalabas siya na 80 pesos each. Not bad, diba? 80 pesos each of the brushes. I remember nung nag-start pa lang ako, bumibili ako ng isa-isang brush sa Glad King. Sa Glad King kasi mga 50 pesos, meron ka ng isang brush. So, yun. Ito naman is kay Mama Antlut. So, sulit na sulit na rin yung 80 pesos. Kung mapapansin nyo, wala pa akong kilay because meron dito na pangkilay na brush. So, this one is an angled brush with a spoolie. So, ito yung gagamitin natin later. Ayan. So, I'm gonna try to do an eye makeup na didiscuss ko kung paano ko gagamitin yung mga uh, brushes na nandito. Okay? Speaking of first time, I'm going to use a palette that I haven't used. This is Caroline Full Face Palette Play to Slay. Oh, full face palette din siya. Parang yung Vice Cosmetics Kavogue palette. So, I have that video. Finiture ko din ang Kavogue palette sa ating channel. So, they, these are the shades. Uh, unahin ko muna yung kilay. Let me try this uh, spoolie. I'm gonna use Iris Essentials PH Deep Brow Pomade. This is in the shade Cold Black. Yung spoolie, maganda siyang makasuklay. So, I love that about the spoolie. Okay, let's see. Oh, okay. So, as you can see, sobrang pigmented nung Deep Brow Pomade. Ayan, pag nagkikilay ako, nag-start ako to line yung lower and then shape ko na yung arc. Ayan, so far maganda siya. Naka, kumakapit yung product very easily. Okay, blend natin. Kapag ka, remember sa pagkikilay, dapat dito hindi ganun kakapal. So you have to blend that out. Okay, so dapat ano lang, um, gradient. So this one is lighter and pa dark siya. Okay, so as you can see, kahit na isang color lang yung ginamit ko sa aking eyebrows, I just made sure na yung stroke ko, or yung, yeah, my stroke is, um, depende lang kung gaano karaming pigment yung gusto ko sa aking kilay. So let me just finish my eyebrows para makapag shadow na tayo. Pansin ko lang doon sa set, walang flat na brush that you can use for concealer. Like, dito nung naglagay ako ng concealer to to shape my eyebrows to clean yung edges or yung mga dito sa may brow bone ko. Walang flat na brush. So, mamaan. Baka meron ka naman dyang pa-flat brush. Okay. So, so first, I'm gonna set the concealer with this like light shade lang siya. Wala namang name yung shades dito. So, I'm gonna use this E02 Flat Blender. Ayan. So, medyo pa. Kita nyo ba? Medyo. 
powdery siya. So, set lang natin sa ating all over the lids lang to set para hindi mag-cake or para, ayan o, nag-fold na yung size ko dito. So, pe-prevent natin yan. So, for the transition color, I'm gonna use the same brush and I'm gonna get this parang light na brown here. So, be careful lang as in sobrang powdery nung palette. So, what I'll do is ilalagay ko lang dito sa my crease. So far, yung feeling kapag ina-apply ko yung eyeshadow with this brush, walang tumutusok na feeling. It's not that soft as the 2.0. Kasi meron dito sa 2.0, meron siyang like ito, yung ito. Um, sabi niya dito, big blending brush that I use for highlighting or powder. Ayan. So, mas malambot itong version 2.0 na set. Pero not bad naman. Okay. So, this color will serve as a transition color. So, now, I'm gonna use this E06 na shader. And then, punta tayo dito. Doon lang sa katabi. No, parang brown shade. So, yeah. Pa-concentrate ko lang din siya doon sa crease na nilagyan natin ng eyeshadow or ng transition color. I-intensify ko lang yung crease color natin. I'm gonna get this E04 Rounded Blender. But, I don't know if round ba siya. For me, it's flat eh. Ayan o. Oh. Okay, so what I'll do is, kita nyo tong nilagay natin na color. Um, I want to blend that yung sa labas using etong transition color na ginamit natin. Above the transition color to make sure na walang harsh line. Sana may mirror na lang tong palette ng Kaolin. Yung mga eye brushes naman is being used depending on your need. Like, for example, iba-ibang shape yung ginamit ko to build up the color. Depende kung saan ko gustong i-concentrate yung pigment. So, if you want to, like, build the color here, that's why I used the shader. It's a uh, medyo flat kasi siya. So, maliit siya na medyo flat. Para makoncentrate siya sa crease, di ba? Mas, mas mapapress mo yung crease mo like that kapag ganito. Okay, so now, if you want to intensify the color, limawa dito sa outer V, we can use yung mga ganito. Ito naman is crease daw siya. Crease yung tawag dito sa brush. This is E05. But we're gonna use this to for the outer V. Okay, so kukunin ko itong pinaka-brown na shade here. Lagay natin siya sa outer V. Mas madali kasing masya-shape kapag ganito kaliit. So actually, first time ko magkaroon ng ganito kaliit na shader brush. So parang nagkakaroon ka na ng wing dito. Actually, dalawa yung maliit na brushes dito. Ito namang isa is a pencil brush. Mamaya, pag medyo doon na tayo sa pinakamaliliit na details, gagamitin natin yung pencil brush. But for now, let's use the same brush. To intensify that, kasi pansin ko parang hindi pa masyado. To intensify further, kunin natin tong darker shade na dito. Okay, so now let's use this pencil brush. This is E09. We're just gonna apply the same color that we applied sa ating crease sa may bottom lash line. Let's now test out this E03 tapered blender. So yeah, gusto ko yung mga ganito. Okay, so just to test it out lang, um, I'll make sure lang na walang mga edges. Kukuha ko ng light shade here, yung brown shade. Tap the excess and then around you around lang doon sa ating eye look na ginagawa. Para lang to make sure na wala tayo harsh line like that. So I love yung feeling. Hindi siya ganun ka sakit. Hindi siya tumutusok. Let's try to put a shimmer dito sa ating inner corner. Let's use this E07 flat shader. Uh, basahin ko lang siya with um, Anne Clutes Beauty Mist. And then, ito yung kukunin natin na shimmer shade. 
Oh my gosh, ang ganda. When you wet the brush and then apply shimmer, I think that it's called foil technique. And usually, I apply shimmers using my finger. Pero with this brush, pasain mo lang ng mist. Pwede na, pwede pwede na. Okay, so sa brush set, ang hindi ko pa nagagamit are the uh, angled shader and this E10 smudger. Hmm. So yung smudger, I think we can use under the eye. Kaso ginamit na natin yung pencil brush. But it can also be used dito. Oh. Yan, yan. Pag gusto mo pang uh, ma-intensify ang iyong under eye. Pero, ang gagawin ko is I'm gonna apply highlight sa ating inner corner. Kunin natin tong sobrang laking highlighter portion sa ano, palette. Well, perfect din siya actually dito sa main bridge ng nose. So, I'm gonna try to put that here. Ayan, bet din siya for highlight. Okay, so this is the smudger. And this angled shader, hmm. Oh, I know. I know, I know, I know. I'm gonna use this for my nose contour. Yung light shade lang muna, nakakatakot eh. So, there. Oh my gosh, that is perfect. Wow! Mama Anne, you're so brilliant. Ah, I've been looking for a perfect brush for my nose. Ito na ata. OMG. So all you have to do is i-blend out mo lang na ganyan. So ako talaga hanggang dulo talaga ako mag nose line. Pero I'm just gonna blend that. Let me just finish my whole look and I'm gonna tell you my final verdict sa Anklet's Brushes I Essential. Hey guys, so this is the final look. Ayan, so naglagay lang ako ng eyeliner and eyelashes. Iba talaga yung dating ng eye look kapag meron kang eyeliner and the lashes. Of course, for my lips, I use my favorite shade from Vice X Antlutes, Budol. Um, this is the Velvet formula. Final verdict for these brushes. Overall, they are okay. I love that it has names doon sa kanyang handle. So, for example, crease shader, flat shader, flat blender. I love that about this brushes. And also, yung itsura niya, mukha siyang like, mukha siyang mamahalin. Alright, so Mama Antlutz is really known for quality products but very affordable. Alam mo yun, parang napagkasya niya dito yung very affordable na brushes. And um, ang ginawa kasi, kasi lang natin is like a um, very simple na brown eyeshadow look, smoky na brown eyeshadow look. But definitely, if I go to colorful eyeshadow looks, ito, et, ito talaga yung gagamitin ko to test out ang ating eye essentials. Yeah, I really do recommend this eye brushes. Very affordable. 800 pesos for 10 pieces. And pansin ko lang din, dito sa, ito kasi yung parang darkest na color na nakuha ko. If you have that eyeshadow palette that is very pigmented, madali kasi siyang makapitan ng pigment. So be careful. Um, labhan nyo agad yung brushes para hindi na siya magmansa. That's a good sign na maganda yung brush kung mabilis siya makapag-pick up ng product. Yun na yung overall verdict ko sa brushes na ito. Let me know if mapapabili ka nito. Hashtag Madge made me buy this. This is definitely a good buy. Before we end this video, meron lang tayo siya shoutout. So, few days ago, in my stories, naglagay ako ng parang sticker for shoutout request. So, unang-unang nag-request is si Rikalin Lakaba. So, shoutout sa'yo, Rikalin. She's one of the majesties. I love you so much. Shoutout sa'yo. Hi! And now, let's feature the comments of the day. Thank you so much for watching and continuously supporting me by liking this video and commenting your honest feedback. Let me know uh, what do you think about the Anklets Eye Essentials and what else would you like me to do? 
Um, let me know any questions na hindi ko napakita na, na magamit using this eye essentials product. Please don't forget to follow me on my social media accounts on Instagram that's Majestic Glam and Manchile Parte. My Facebook page is Manchile Parte. Follow nyo na ang aking page. My Kumo TikTok and like account is MajBL. I'm gonna see you on my next video. Ciao!